Hello guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be doing something that I haven't done in a while. But let's get straight into it. As you guys saw from my like most recent shorts, I went for a little toy hunt at Target. and found this hot baby for like 35 bucks. Pretty good box art and all that. This was designed by Brand Randy Falk and Trevor Zamet. The sculpt is by Tony Kip Kipurano. He did amazing. Any of you guys want to see that? But let's get, you know, straight into it. This looks like a great figure, and I'm happy I purchased it. So, yeah, let's hop right into it. All right, guys. So... I kind of just changed the camera angle. We're going to start doing most of these reviews top down. So yeah, let's get straight into this. So first I'm going to cut this bad boy. This tape off, because I kind of don't want to mess up this box. What? I don't know if my head got in the way. I think. Nope. Apparently we didn't cut it off, guys. I don't know if any of you guys who watch my account are soccer fans, but my dad just got me some tickets to go see. New England Revolution versus Inter Miami. I don't know if Messi's going to play, but I, I, I'm going and I'm excited, guys. I personally think Ronaldo's better. Please don't start a war in my comments. So here's the fig itself. You can barely see. I'm trying to give you guys a really, you know, good top down angle here which that's the only way we could do it my monitor sadly is not tilted that way so we'll just continue it like this i mean it doesn't look that bad i hate these scissors We'll be back after this ad. All right, guys, we are back after a very short ad. But yeah, amazing ad. So here we got Metalhead himself. His articulation is very tight, so I'm really scared that I'm gonna break any joints. As you guys can see, I'm just struggling trying to bend this arm of his. I'm really scared because I don't want to mess up any joints. Because this figure looked so well. I, w I think I might put it in hot water. I mean, that's a good solution to it. He, either way, he moves somewhat smoothly. Now I just want to get to all these little details. I'm pretty sure that his chest opens. Little, like, rubber inside plastic on his actual chest the head sculpt and as i mentioned the sculpt in general looks good this this is a little lever which does go up and down but either way he has some good head articulation well almost all of his other he has a good leg and this arm he's like articulated all around on his arms which is pretty cool What's up, guys? I need to close my door. Sorry for this interruptment. And he comes with a ton of accessories, as seen right here on this side. I really don't have much to say about the fig. I mean, the colors are amazing. It did come with this one little scuff. Paint's pretty chipped. But this is an old figure, and I just randomly found it back on shelves. 
now, which, guys, a video, well, like, this might be coming out near the summer. And I'm going to be doing a comparison of which is better. The Super 7 Metalhead or the NECA, as you can see, I bought the NECA already. Now I just need to wait for the Super 7. As you move his joints around a little bit, they slowly loosen up, which I enjoy and makes me a lot less worried. Kind of loosening up. His legs, yeah, his legs are fine. I'm just very scared that I might end up breaking this beautiful thing. So next, we're going to take these accessories out one by one and look at them and kind of get into detail. Oh my God. Are you kidding me, bro? Scissors kind of scraped the freaking vacuum, as you can see. I'll try painting over that. Nope. I wasn't even me. That's the paint. The paint is actually chipping off all around. Let me see. Yeah, these colors do not match. Alright. Well, that's kind of sad. Do you guys think these two colors will make the color of a vacuum? I think maybe. Or does this look better for the vacuum? No, it's, actually, it might be perfect. But I can't believe that happened. Got a little scratch. Nothing too broke. Hopefully it wasn't from those scissors. I think it was. Alright. We'll just get that taken care of. I can't believe that scraped off, bro. It's so disappointing. I think right there in that little hole is where the metal has little chest gun thing would come. Alright, now we're just gonna remove these hands of him, his, which are put in there pretty well. Okay, we got it. Nice. I can't believe that happened. I cannot believe that. Don't worry, I'll try to get my dad to like draw over it maybe. All right, nice. We got our little queen and metal head. These are actually plastic. They're like a really soft plastic. If it wants to go in correctly. Yep, it's not going in. What is my luck? All right. We just fairly, barely got it in. All right, I think the only way to put this on the floor is by putting metal head forward a bit. Now I just need to try to lay his arm back. What? How do you how do you freaking do this? Alright, so we gotta open his legs, tilt him a bit, and lean his arm forward. Open legs. Oh, the vacuum is articulated. Whoop, whoop. I love NECA, guys. So there we go. We got Metalhead with his little vacuum. As you guys can see, 
The vacuum does have minor articulation. M Metalhead's gonna be cleaning the whole house with this one. Well, all those little things, that little headphones he has. All the red. Whoop, whoop. Amazing figure. I love his little utility belt. His utility belt is like, feels like the same material this is made out of. I'm trying to get into like a ton of detail. As you guys can see, the sculpting is amazing. I'm really happy I picked this up. I'm just really scared that anything else gets messed up. Oh my lord, guys. And we'll be right back after the set. Okay, guys, we retrieved it. We got his little drill. Which for me, it came a little curved. Don't like how they didn't finish that off. Now we're gonna switch out his that 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 looks very good. All right, now we're gonna switch out his vacuum for his drill. Man, yeah, but we're gonna listen to drill music. The only hard thing about putting on the accessories of this figure are putting on any accessories that are like that, where they have a little hole in the peg. I understand that goes trying to... Get... Oh, and the cell shading looks amazing on this. I had to point that out. This figure is so bulky. Which, it's kind of why... Oof, this metalhead is amazing. Love all the bright, vibrant colors and how it looks so cartoony. I love the bright, vibrant colors on this guy. His arms are articulated, but for some reason they're not articulating. Oh no, now they are. He has the force. Wrong. Alright, so his arms have some articulation. Just gotta move everything around in order to get it. I'm just scared that any of these will freaking, you know, break. Because I'm really trying to keep this figure in some wealthy well condition. Alright, now it's time for his little chest piece. Yes, we're gonna do all of the, like, Cool add on accessories next. Yeah. Oh. Like that. Oh, it is. So it's like that. And that little wire should go right into place. So I'm gonna check if that's correct. Which it is. No matter what's supposed to come with another. His mouth's articulated, everyone. Is it? His mouth is articulated. NECA went all out. Ooh -wee! Articulated mouth. This chest piece looks so fantastic. <laughs> I love this figure. <laughs> Alright, 
got a normal fist hand. Looking pretty sharp. And we got another fist hand. Basically, you know, the same thing and all. But to make this easier for me and this video a little shorter and, you know, not bore you guys, I'm gonna take all the accessories out and show you when I'm done. Alright, guys. So I took out one hand and I'm already taking out the next one. So we got this little hand looks somewhat open. Maybe you can, well, you can't use it with the vacuum. I got my hopes up a little too high. And we got this and this. And with the open hands that he comes with additionally, this figure was amazing. And I think it was worth the price of $35. What do you guys think? Comment down below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure, make sure to like and subscribe for more content like this. I will be posting more stop motion soon. Soon and shorts will be coming soon. I love this thing just to add on. It's not even like it has a, like cell shading, most of the accessories do, but it's just that outline and the vibrant colors that add so much on, especially all the accessories. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Stay tuned for more Target toy hunts, toy hunts in general. Toy reviews, Funko Fridays, Thursday toy talks, everything. I hope you guys really enjoyed today's video. And I'm really happy that I got to buy this figure and look deep down and, you know, just explore it. Thank you guys for your time. Like and subscribe. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. Peace.